Robert Tellis is expected to take the stand in his own defense, the former politician accused of killing investigative journalist Jeff Gehrman. Thanks for joining us here at 6. I'm Denise Valdez. And I'm Brian Loftus. Our 8 News Now investigators bringing live reports and updates throughout the entire day from this murder trial. Vanessa Murphy has the latest now from the Regional Justice Center. Robert Tellis receiving somewhat of a warning from prosecutors and his attorneys that taking the stand in his defense could work against him. Prosecutor Chris Hamner pointing out if Tellis claims he has good character, this opens him up to cross-examination to possibly show otherwise. His defense attorney, Robert Draskovich, responding he did bring up concerns about potential pitfalls with Tellis. This trial starting with prosecutors presenting nearly 30 witnesses, most of them law enforcement, who pointed to a trail of evidence linking Tellis to investigative reporter Jeff Gehrman murder in September of 2022. So far, we've heard from only two witnesses for the defense. At least two more are expected before Tellis takes the stand, likely by Wednesday afternoon. I spoke with Draskovich before he left court. What do you want to say about him taking the stand? He has wanted to tell his story since long before I was retained on this case. I remember seeing him on TV and various news outlets saying that he wanted to tell his story anticipate him telling that story tomorrow. The evidence appeared to be overwhelming. How much is your work cut out for you? It's been cut out before, since before the trial started. We've addressed the evidence the best we can. Obviously, facts, circumstances are things that we generally have to deal with in very serious cases, including this one. In an interview with me from jail last year, Tellis claimed he was framed. This could give some indication as to what he may say on the stand. How do you explain your vehicle near his home? How do you explain the video of an individual who appears to be you? How do you explain the clothing that was at your house? How do you explain the DNA? As far as the vehicle goes, that there's a vehicle that looks like mine. As far as any other evidence goes, again, as far as what time it may have been planted, I couldn't say. You know, again, I know it's an incredible story, but that is the story. It could appear that you're, you're grasping at straws here because you know about the evidence against you. And again, if that's what people want to believe, then they can. But again, I'm telling you the truth. Jeff Gehrman reported on allegations of a possible inappropriate relationship between Tellis and a woman in the Clark County Public Administrator's office. She was a witness for the state, but prosecutors never asked her about the allegations. They did, however, show this video of the two of them in the back of a vehicle from Gehrman's story. So if Tellis takes the stand and tries to say he's a family man with good character, again, this could be risky. Reporting in downtown Las Vegas, Vanessa Murphy, 8 News Now. Tellus's attorney says he only has a couple more witnesses to call until he rests his case. That means the jury could have the case by the end of this week.